But not everyone was thrilled about it. On its very first run, July 25th, 1972, the APTE rolled out from Derby and was immediately pulled from service. Why? The driver's union. ASLEF wasn't happy about the single driver seat, fearing it would lead to job cuts. That protest meant the train sat idle for over a year before it could hit the main line again. Fast forward to August 10th, 1975. This beast was back. And what did it do? It hit a new British railway speed record. 152.3 miles per hour, 245.1 kilometres per hour on the Great Western Main Line. It also tore up the tracks on the Midland Main Line and the old Dalby Test Track hitting 143.6 miles per hour, 231.1 kilometers per hour, in 1976. But despite all its potential, the APTE was never meant for public service. After a few years of testing, it was retired in June 1976 and sent to the National Railway Museum in York, where you can still see it today at the NRM Locomotion Museum in Shildon.